I know some people have been talking about they've been having issues with the calculator. So I want to teach you how to reset your calculator if for some reason you're not getting the correct answers. So if you go ahead and turn the calculator on, the first thing that you want to do is you want to do second plus. And if you scroll down to number seven and hit enter, you can reset all the RAM. So if you hit one, and then you hit 2, it'll show that your RAM's cleared. So what that does is that cleans out the memory for you just in case something gets stuck. And then I always do this. I do second plus 7, 2, 2. And that sets it back to the defaults you got when you first turned on the calculator when you opened the package. Another great thing to do is an easy way to clear clear your list in statistics is to go to second plus four enter and that clears all the lists that you have. So that way if you're in L1 if I go to stats now and hit enter all my lists are clear. Another helpful function especially for regression where some people don't have this is if you go to, let's go back to our, let me turn it off for a second. Oh, here I am on the main screen. If you go to second catalog, scroll all the way down, it might take a while, to diagnostic on. And if you see here, it's all, it's a lot of the functions that you see in the calculator section. So you're going to do diagnostic on, enter, enter again. What that does is when we run regression it gives us A, B, R, and R squared. Everything we need to solve the problems. So again the two first steps I showed you for were resetting the RAM and resetting the defaults. The third thing I showed you was for clearing the list and the fourth thing I showed you was for setting it up for the regression. I hope this helped. Thanks.